Yeah, I mean, I think it goes back to Vinny's first question. You know, I'm trying to establish some physicality with our guys up front. Right there at the three-yard line, you got to pound it in, right? Turnover, sudden change. Should be able to punch that ball in. And it's not going to change. I mean, we're going to keep working on it, go back to the lap. And listen, uh, three out of the last four, I thought we did a good job rushing the ball. And then, obviously, we came against a team that stopped the run. Yeah, I mean, that's, that was part of our identity and DNA that, you know, we've been harping on. We harped on in training camp. We're going to continue to harp on it. I mean, still a lot of game left, right? Not, not where we want to be at two and six. Obviously, we understand that. Um, but we'll go back to it. Right? Put pads on on Fridays the last couple of weeks, just trying to build that mindset, that mentality with the group, and we're going to stay with it. Yeah, I don't know, man. We just uh, sustained a couple of good drives, had some some big third down plays by the receivers. Uh, the, run, the run was hitting. Um, and then just, yeah, it's hard to say, you know, one thing or another. Um, fell out of it uh, for a stretch there, but that's the challenge. Just got to be more consistent, got to score in the red zone and uh, take care of the ball. Was it, is it a little frustrating, though, given you guys were close to, to winning this one, you know, kind of have some of the, you know, self-inflicted mistakes that kind of held you back a little bit? I would say so. I mean, any anytime things don't go your way, especially as hard as we go, as hard as we practice, it'll be a little frustrating, but... It's football, man. It's a learning experience at the end of the day. And if you don't see it as that, then it's going to be a long year for you. How did that feel to walk away with a pick? Uh, it always feels good, you know, to, <clears throat> to get a turnover. But, um, you know, it wasn't, it wasn't just me on there. You know, it was a tip ball from, from Big Jank up front. So I started there and then, you know, it just happened to fall in my hands. And so, you know, sometimes it's just how it goes. Game is ball. That, yeah, it's that ball. <laughs> yeah, this is it right here. Uh, like I said, I loved our fight, man. Like, I loved our effort. Um, I loved our violence. I loved how we was talking. Um, we just got to finish. I mean, that's, you know, the bottom line. Um, when you lose a game, we just got to finish. Find a way to get off the, uh, the field on third down. Um, you know, just continue to get the ball away from the guys. So. How do you guys stay together when you're on a losing streak like this right now? As a man, team? That's all you can do. I mean, there's a lot of football left. Got to keep working. You know, we work all year round to come out here and win football games. So, like I said, you just got to find ways to win. Every time you lose, I mean, there's nothing good about losing. So, I don't care who we're playing. I expect to win every time I go out there and be at my best. And um, got to just find ways to win. So, I don't, you know, I don't do moral victories. You just got to, there's obviously some good things. Um, you got to take those into consideration, but it wasn't good enough. So, back to the drawing board. What can you say about Tyree Wilson and his growth, his development, the game he had? Yeah, he's playing well. Um, he's getting better, putting in the work, and the results are starting to show.